Hello guys, my name is Fox and welcome to part 71 of our Circuits 2 Game of Thrones mod where we're playing as a High King Hank, the second of Crusher's Daughters. Let's continue. So, in the previous episode we have launched our invasion of Mir and for some miraculous reason the vassals didn't call, didn't got called into this war like separately. So now I could control their armies, which is just perfect. Which is gonna allow me to finish this war a lot uh, a lot easier and yeah, I could just control everything, which is perfect. And we already almost finished all the sieges we needed. There's only like a couple provinces left. I might even consider... Cool. Uh, I might even consider sieging down Mir completely just to take all of these provinces and... Or just to take all of these holdings because these guys might be annoying if they were to stay... Uh, wrong religion, wrong culture. So let's go and get one extra army and drop it on Mir. Maybe we might even just go and assault it because they're yeah, just vassal armies, so who cares? No, I'm not gonna allow you to surrender quite yet. 16,004. Mm, no, we need some extra if you want to assault. Let's go and bring 7,000 extra and see what we're gonna do with them. Yeah, yeah, my heir need to improve, I know. My half-sister is still my heir. Oh, now she's been educated by... by a diplomat guy, probably because our martial one died at some point. Yeah, this event again, I didn't understand what you want from me. Like, you want them to give away some Dutch or something, but... Why are you... Ask me, ask your leash. Okay, uh, yeah, yeah, let's go and assault it. Don't care about the losses, really. Because it's not my own troops. Mm, High King, yeah. <laughs> and just continue inheriting the same cities over and over and over again. And they're not building... Or they're not getting themselves wives at all. Also, what we need to do is level up some extra training grounds for all of the sweet labor reinforcement rate. And in our capital, training grounds in there is the max level. Okay. Let's get you what then? And now extra barracks. Try not to waste too much money. Stop asking. I'm gonna I'm gonna send you the request when I'm gonna be ready. Hmm, we actually might lock troops to sort all the other ones. So let's go and bring some extra. Hmm. Okay. Have a siege in here. And siege in there. So two extra castles in Mir, and then we're gonna finish this war. Let's hope everything's gonna be nice and awesome. And no one's gonna be unhappy. Sure, some extra slaves for me to sell. Sure. Okay, you're ready to go, I think. Let's go and siege down the trade post as well, for no real reason. Uh, okay, everything siege down, right? Mm. Oh, you do have a holding in here as well. I don't care. Enforce demands. Yay! Look at this. It now looks kind of beautiful. Uh, so, let's stand down everything. And you, and you. And boats as well. Now a lot of vassal management, as always. Mm -hmm. I shouldn't let my uh, my region do this because she's gonna freaking uh, ruin everything. Actually, hope she's not gonna decline. She's not gonna decline my offer to give away the kingdom because she might. Okay, Mir, yeah, I'm just gonna create a whole bunch of random dudes, and Mir is probably gonna be the capital. Uh, the capital of 
whatever kingdom we're gonna create in here. Also, this thing is a part of the Jurmir as well, right? So we're gonna transfer this vassal to here. How's the Jurmir looking? What about this province? It's a part of the Jur list. Oh, okay. So this one I need to give away to you. I just want to keep everything in the Jur borders because... Uh, that looks better. So, you need Masuloch. Masuloch. Take it. And... You have all of that. What about these two provinces? This is a part of Pentos. This is a part of Roinar. Hmm. Should I just, just consider creating... Two, two separate vassals in here? Probably. Mm-hmm. Okay, is it everything I need to give away? Yeah, looks like it now. Uh, man, not in present any marriage, not a ruler, religion, culture, adult, not a great house. Fortune, diplomacy, seven stewardship. Yeah, looks looks fine. So you're gonna receive Mir. No, not the Bay of Mir. The Mir. And... Do I have the kingdom already? I do. Could I give it to, away to you right away, or do I need a duchy? I could. So, yeah. Receive that. Hope you're gonna be happy. And... My Siloch going to this guy, and this two. Yeah, I'm just gonna create vassals in here. And when we're gonna conquer Pentas or Roinar, I don't know if we could even create Roinar. Has the culture group Dornish men. Dornish? Interesting. No. So, we're probably not gonna be able to create this kingdom. At all. Is this guy also Dornish men? Roinar Dornish men. So they have... The same culture group as this guy, so... Oh, that's interesting. Cool. Huh. But what I'm gonna do with this province then? Actually, even if, if I... Even if I am gonna have just... A random vassal in here, it's not gonna hurt in any way, right? So... That's what... You're basically gonna do. So you're gonna receive... Lore something. And you're gonna receive Lake of Mirth. Uh... Must be able to produce airs. What's wrong with you? No. About you. Okay. Great. So now we have this thing. Now we have that thing. The only thing that looks ugly is Tyrosh. Because... What do we have in here, Tyrosh? You have a province in Bay of Mir, but I don't know which one. Doesn't matter, really. Manage to do vassal management. This guy should... Like me well enough. Do we have any... Anyone we could marry to you? We could marry our heir to you, but no. It's actually... Gonna be a terrible idea. You want to marry my mother? Sure! Why not? And actually, it's changed my regent. Hmm, that's not great. And we're only seven years old. Oh. Regent, do you want an honorary title? Yeah, just... Just try to stay high... Opinion of me. And don't decline any of my offers. What are we gonna do with Tyrosh? Is there any way for me to... To change his religion, change his culture, educate his heirs? Probably not. Could I revoke any titles from you? Ah, I could revoke an honorary title. Nope. I could grant you independence, but that's stupid. What about Liz? Are we gonna be trying to... Oh. There's an invasion of Dorn happening? What the hell? Defending against Magister Beck as a liberator in Magister's Beck invasion of Dorn. And Dorn actually winning. Huh, you idiot. So, Liz attacking Dorn. You have 3000 troops, they have 8000. Why you even decided. Also, why we lost the province we had in Stepstones? The Skull's been controlled by us. What the hell? Bullshit. Let's go and look at the history of this thing. 
So my father controlled it, granted, inherited, conquered as a claimant. Oh, so you just lost to some, to some host or something when I've been not paying attention. Oh well. How is this guy doing with his vassals and stuff? Looks like he seems to be handling everything well enough. I became zealous. Yeah, it's actually... Oh, this guy is cynical, so he's not gonna allow me, probably. God damn it. I would really like to be zealous, but oh well. So, okay, what's the next thing we're gonna be doing? First of all, we need some new law speaker. Sure. We're gonna be trying to improve relations with this guy. And we need a new healer. A genius and a red priest. <laughs> Might be dangerous to have a red woman around our court. Sure, I'll just have you as a healer. Maybe it's gonna give me some interesting events, but I doubt it, but still. You're gonna be my Melisandre. More idea. Sure. Uh, okay. I wonder... What is that? Master Baron of Embercross, your regent, has decided in his... Oh! <sighs> Why? Why is it happening? So he just stole high growth. Oh, at least you're a wildling. But apparently it doesn't fucking matter, because he's still... Where's the all the upgrades gone now? Oh, you're... What? What's happened? Why is your top holding is a city? Okay, Wildland Bergs are still here. You bastard. And apparently I granted your lordship. No, you just stole them. Okay. Even though he had high opinion of me, he still decided to freaking steal. And I couldn't do anything about that. But what I am gonna do, I'm gonna execute him as soon as I gonna be allowed to. Unfortunately, I couldn't really do much about him right now. Because he's my regent. And we're still almost like 10 years away from being able to do anything on our own. Who are you? Just a random guy. 10 gold. What if I were to sell you into slavery? No one gonna mind it. Okay. Is there any way for, for me to avoid such things? My mother not not been stolen and stealing anything from me. So I probably should have not gave her away to this guy. But at least, yeah, at least the Wildling Barracks and all of the upgrades did not get destroyed, but doesn't really matter that much, because I'm not, control, not in the control of it anymore. Do I at least have claim on that? I have... I'm getting only a weak claim, really. Could I attack you right away? No. I couldn't do anything while you're my regent. And we lost our healer already. Oh, we have a new red prison here. Sure. So... I wonder, if we were to declare a war on Bravos right now, is it gonna work the same as we did, uh, as it worked for Mir? It probably only worked for Mir in this way, because, I don't know, maybe Mir were involved in some war, and that's just must, and just must up with, uh, with all the stuff. What if I were to declare one lease right now? They're currently in the middle of war, and they couldn't really do much. And I've already replenished quite a few troops. Sure, let's go and try it. Let's see how it's gonna work out. Invasion of Lys. And now it... Now this system is working. Maybe it was a little bit of a glitch. Yeah, as long... As long as your guys gonna join in, and I wouldn't need to do any work myself, I would be fine. Oh, of course this guy decided against it. What about Mir? Why the fuck you're not joining? You have hundred... Opinion of me. And you're not joining? <sighs> oh. <laughs> yeah, sure. As long as they're breaking free. Or not. They're not even breaking free. But he immediately gets Liberation Revolt. And this guy gets a Liberation Revolt immediately. <laughs> this fucking system. 
is so broken. Okay, let's go and raise our personal... Oh, I don't even have boats. Yeah, sure. Uh, let's go and get our personal troops and at least fight with these liberations because they probably not going to be able to handle it themselves because of reasons. Uh, could I please raise any more boats somewhere? 11 more here. Okay. Is it going to be enough? Still not going to be enough to bring my army. Oh, so all of this freaking ports I built. All of the docks, all of the other things, still not enough. And I couldn't even upgrade it anymore in the capital at least. Hmm. And in here I only have no troops whatsoever. Okay, how am I supposed to help you now? I need... Okay, let's raise mercenary boats. Yes, that's, that's how we've been handling it last time. Let's just raise some mercenary fleet and use them to move around. My first trader wants to marry Shug. Sure, go marry. Let's go and hire another one mercenary fleet. Hey, first of all, let's go and help you. Are you guys going to be able to do anything? Yeah, you're sieging down capital fleece. I guess it's nice. Just, uh, Volantis, try not to lose... Never mind. <laughs> try not to lose the entirety of your army to this Liberation Revolt, I wanted to ask, but... Uh, you're not capable of doing such things. You're not capable of being smart. Uh, also, we've just received a slave, so let's go and sell him. Okay, 40 ducats, sure. Now let's go and fight this thing. Who are you even? Isle of Woman, Tall Trees Town. And you don't have... <laughs> you don't even have enough troops to siege down this. So pathetic. Yeah. When I'm raising troops on my own, I could raise 15,000 troops from you. When you're joining as an ally, you only provide 3,000. How does it make sense? Mm, I don't know, it doesn't, really. And there's no way for me to avoid it. I've got a, uh, an advice in the comments to, like, create an empire in Essos instead of empire in here. But I don't know how it's gonna help me, because this system still gonna be in place, and they're still gonna be joining the war as my allies. And they're still gonna be providing nothing, and half of them still... Half of them still gonna be uh, just uh, declining my offers. And also the fun part is, I couldn't even punish anyone for not joining my war. And I think it should be kind of, I think. Because how dare you decline the call to arms from your leash? It should be punishable, but in here it's not. For some reason. Okay, now you have... Are you fucking kidding me? He revoked the second province from me. Okay, that's now starting to get ridiculous. <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised if he's gonna rev revoke Jala Whale from me as well. <laughs> Great, yeah. The Regency is definitely not broken. He's fucking revoking all of my titles, and I couldn't even do anything about this. I only received a fucking weak claim. Which is gonna expire, like... Oh, that's so stupid. I know it's maybe kind of... Kind of like... Uh, mm, what's the word I'm looking for? It's kind of realistic, maybe. That he's... That he could steal the title from me while... Uh, while I'm just a boy. A young boy of six, but... <laughs> I don't know. Still really stupid that he's just he's just doing it like no no problem. There should be someone who could oppose him. I don't know some kind of council. Maybe with conclave something gonna change. And not and not with the uh, creators of this mod would be actually able to uh, to get conclave 
properly working. Actually, there shouldn't be too much problem to get Conclave to work with this mod. But I wonder how they're gonna do this. Maybe they're gonna introduce some interesting things. And yeah, they're gonna be able to uh, in, uh, to get like a um, the hand of the king and all of these other titles to be working as like Conclave members or whatever it's called. Yeah, it would be kind of interesting, maybe, to see. Okay, we've stitched down everything we need except Liz. We're not gonna be able to force them to assault Liz, but it also already time for me to have a break, guys, so I'm gonna do this. And this guy, gonna pay for all he's done. Let's hope he's not gonna be able to make babies soon enough, because if he would, I wouldn't have been able, able to kill him and take his titles like this. And we're like five years away from uh, Regency starting. So, if you enjoyed watching this, you could leave a like. If you want to see more, you could subscribe. And if you want to leave a comment, you should definitely do it. And there is also some rebellions happening here. Why is this independent? I don't know. But yeah, see you later, guys. Bye-bye.